Good morning, Peace Lab. I'm Johnny. And I'm Val, and we're here with your morning announcements. SAD will be meeting Tuesday, December 5th at 7 a.m. in room 612 in Plymouth. We will finalize our plans for our cafeteria event. Did you know that there is a fashion club at Peace Lab? At Fashion Club, you can create designs, make new clothing, learn how to sew, and so much more. If you have an eye for aesthetics, like to draw, love sewing, or you even just like cute clothes, this club is the place for you. No matter what you wear, everyone is welcome. No experience is necessary. Come join the Fashion Club every other Monday from 2.30 to 3.30 at Salem High School, room 1214, in Miss Osborne's room. Their next meeting is today, December 4th. You can keep up, keep up with them on Instagram, at Peace Up Fashion, and through their remind, at FS Club 23. Join them today. It can be as easy as taking a selfie video on your phone, and you can win up to $2,500. The Suburban Collection's Focus on the Road video contest helps bring awareness to the dangers of distracted driving. Create a 45-second or less video with your phone, a DSLR camera, or other video equipment. To learn more about the contest and the prices, visit suburbanfocusontheroad.com. Submissions can be made now, and they are due December 16, 2023, by 11.59 p.m. Let's take a break and go to a news bit with Jacob about the Sphinx of Egypt. Good morning, Peace Up. I'm Jacob Carr, and I'm here with your news bit. We've long thought the Sphinxes of Egypt to be fully man-made statues, toiled over and carved by laborers over a long period of time. Why wouldn't they be? Big sand lines with human heads don't disappear out of nowhere. Or do they? New research suggests that maybe they do, mostly. Experiments have been done by scientists recently on model yardangs, landforms in the desert that form from a wind erosion on compact sand. These experiments have simulated wind erosion on the models using water tunnels, and the data shows that when the erosion is simulated, the models form a mane at the top and sort of a feline spine throughout the body. This is not 100% proof that they are not as artificial as we thought they were, but it's good enough speculation. That's all for your news bet. Peace out. Community Financial Credit Union will be at all schools this month. Students who deposit $5 or more will receive free cookies from the school store. The credit union will be at Plymouth on December 8th and Salem on December 15th. Attention juniors and seniors, the Career Center is your place to get information on colleges, military, and professional trades. To find more details and to register, juniors and seniors should go to the Career Center webpage and click on the upcoming webpage visit schedule. You can also keep an eye out for our post on our Instagram, at PSEP Career Center. Are you looking for a job? Check out the virtual job board on the Career Center webpage. The job board is updated regularly. The Park Players Theater Company is putting on the production of a 1940s radio Christmas Carol on December 8th, 9th, 15th, and 16th at 7 p.m. in the Gloria Logan Auditorium. You can buy tickets at the door or online for $12 at pptc.booktix.net. Come out to see this incredible show. That's all for your announcements, Peace Up. Now to sports. Good morning, Peace Up. I'm Jacob with your sports. Your Detroit Pistons continued their recent awful play over the weekend with a loss to the Cleveland Cavaliers. Their losing streak now stands at a franchise record 17 games. In better news, though, your Detroit Lions got back on the winning track with a 33-28 win over the New Orleans Saints. And Michigan football defeated Iowa 26-0 to become the 2023 Big Ten champions. In the ensuing final college football playoff rankings, Michigan moved up to number one in the country for the first time this season. They will be joined in the playoff by Washington, Texas, and of course Alabama, who they will play in the Rose Bowl on January 1st. These selections resulted in the controversial decision to leave unbeaten ACC champ Florida State out of the playoff. This comes in the final year of the four-team format, as in 2024, college football will move to the 12-team format. That's all for your sports piece up. Have a good day. Good morning, Plymouth Canton Educational Park. I'm August Farmer with the weather. Today we will see lows of 32 and highs of 39. It will be very cloudy today. Have a spectacular day. Peace up. Good morning, Peace Up. I'm Ellie Roper here with your Peace Up basketball teams. Hi, I'm Bradley Zuka. I'm a combo guard at Cannes High School. Uh, I'm Alexander Persinger. I'm a guard at Cannes. Um, I'm Lucas Porter. 
I'm a guard at Plymouth High School. I'm Zach Jones. I'm a guard at Plymouth. So what aspects of your game have you been actively working on to improve, and what progress have you seen? Um, for us, I'd definitely say defense. Um, we take time to work on defense every day at practice. We also work on finding the open player on time and being able to move the ball up and down the court and in the half court, and definitely rebounding. Um, we do multiple rebounding drills at practice. So being able to chin it with two hands and get the loose balls in each rebound is important for us. And we've only played one game, so the progression is, there's a little bit of it, but the more games we play and as the season goes on, we'll be able to visualize how much progression we're making. Okay, and how do you handle pressure situations such as crucial moments in a game? Um, that, I feel like that really just comes with a lot of experience and like playing at the varsity level for a year or two years. And then also when we're working so hard in the off season, it's kind of like second nature to us that we're just like already prepared for that moment. You all had a pretty successful season last year, especially Kent and making it to district finals. How do you think your team this year is looking and do you have high hopes for this last season? Um, I like our chances for this season. Um, we just got to win on Saturday and uh, super high hopes. I think we should keep getting better. And how do you prepare for a game and how does that compare to how you get ready for a park rivalry game? I usually take a nap before every game and then just chill with the guys before every game. All right, thank you so much. I'm here with Grace West, country pop star and former Peace Up alum. How are you doing today? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm doing incredible. So what made you want to perform at this event? So uh, Silver Bells actually reached out a few months ago and asked if I would like to do it. And I said, absolutely, of course, uh, in the state capital of where I'm from. Right. So it was a huge honor. Mm -hmm. So why are community events such as Silver Bells in the city important to you? Um, just, I think this one especially, just being back home with the community of, I mean, 35 to 40,000 people are here every single year. So being here with everyone and being able to share music and just the event with everyone has been amazing. Super and, important. Yeah. And what message do you have for the students back home at PSEP? I would say whatever it is that you want to do, no matter how unconventional you think it is, if your family maybe might not believe in you 100% with what you want to do, go for it, no matter what it is. If it's music, if it's art, if it's anything that you think is unconventional, if it's your dream, and if it's what you want to do with your life, go for it. You can always go back to school. I mean, in my case, you can always go back to school. You can always get a degree, but if it's what you love, you should go for it. Great. And what is your personal favorite Christmas song? Ooh, so today I sang Last Christmas. That's definitely up there. That's one of my favorites. Um, I don't want to say all I want for Christmas is you by Brian Carey because <laughs> that's a horrible, like everybody hears all the time. But I think that Last Christmas and Happy Christmas by John Lennon. Incredible yeah. choices.